Right, so welcome back guys. Uh, in the previous video, we've seen the application that we are going to build, which is this one, right? Now, coming to the code, uh, we am using Visual Studio Code Editor. As you know, I told you this was my friend and you are welcome to use any other editor of your liking provided you can follow along what I'm doing here. So we are going to get rid of this one and build a new component together, all right? Which will be like so, okay? So let's go on and do that now. So if I come to app.js, um, in app.js, I'm going to get rid of this one, right? And we're going to create the same one together, all right? So if I save this, go there, right? We have a clean page, okay? So let's get cracking, guys. Now, in our components folder, we want to create a new component that we are going to call to do dot js like so and we're going to have a class component rather than a function component so we're gonna do rce then it will be like that we don't need that export there right in here we're going to need a constructor a constructor like so okay then we need to have super as well right then we're going to have our state in here state So then in the state, uh, we saw we had the task, initialize that with nothing, then we had allocation, allocation, uh, initialize that with nothing uh, what's the complaint here is this a dot yeah right then we've got our start date start date initialize it with nothing then start time start time like that initialize it with nothing and we're going to copy this for brevity copy that paste that there then we want to change this to we want to change that to oh what am i doing we want to change this so control d so i want to change that to end right okay so we've got our state here we'll come back to it and uh, also if you remember from last time when i was initializing the side nav 
uh, we did the initialization uh, in this um, uh, in uh, component did mount which is cm did this one yeah so this is where we did our initialization okay right so so we also yeah so now we do have our state we have our component did mount to initialize our date then now we can come up to the markup for our form so if we go over to materialize we want to get this here and this is this is from forms and is the input uh, that I want and so I'm copying from this div here right up to this one here so in this case if I copy this we we'll need to close that div there and we we'll need to close this form so let's copy this come here paste it like so and what we are going to do we are going to close the form first right so close the form like so and then close the div the div we're going to close it like that okay and not die but div right now we need to sort out the class here so class needs changing so control d to select the rest and we can change that to class name yeah now it's still complaining and the complaint is we've got these not closed jx will jsx will complain right any more complaints no happy save this let's have a look at what we have yeah still no complaints which is good now what we can do is maybe we can now get this component in here then we'll develop further so we'll have it like that and it's now a to do component yeah right to do component like so save go back here refresh that right we've got some errors here with the four okay guys at the moment we'll leave it like that then uh, we'll finish in the next uh, video okay